Good morning. This is the second attempt of the video. I had the camera turned the other way. And I really wanted you to see what I was showing you. And not me without my makeup and shower. So, I'm doing a full fire breakfast. And sorry you missed the process. But I scrambled up some eggs over here. And uh, I'm just going to pour it over potatoes. Oh, that smoke is terrible. Well, there's a big story I wanted to tell you about. Okay. Okay. Now we got it right. I believe. You see that big piece on the bottom in the fire? Okay. Um, I could poke it. This piece right there. Okay? Right there. Okay. When I first put it in the fire, uh, after the fire, a bunch of wriggly termites came crawling out of it. And they were still alive. I could not believe it. But they were. Okay, this fire pit was not originally here. I moved it from here. Okay, and uh, see that big rock that was too heavy, so I didn't try to move it. Um, yeah, it had all these rocks on the other side, and this can, this is my can. That was somebody else's can. Anyway, um, it concerns me that there's a termite infestation because it can take over the trees and trees can start falling down if they start rotting from the inside and you just never know. It's kind of scary. But clearly, people have been using this rotten stump uh, probably as fat wood. I'm not sure if it is fat wood anyway, but I think it is good fire starter nonetheless. But I looked in it and there was little wormies in it. So there is an infestation going on. I don't know if they know about it and they might be irritated by me telling them, but I'm, I'm going to mention it anyway. Because <coughs> who knows, a tree could be rotten and then fall down for no reason. Well, that's interesting that um, this tree that clearly was a stump and now has branches growing out of it. You know, it's obviously not how it naturally grew, but it's just interesting how it does that. And I wonder if, no, I don't even think it's the same it's not the same tree it's it's seat from seedlings that were dropped or spread by the wind or birds or who knows interesting anyway i real this is a beautiful this is one of the nicest spots i've camp sites i've ever had it's very nice the area where i am has very nice campsites some of them are kind of narrow but, uh, but there are a lot of nice ones, very naturist, nature-like, which is, okay, the phone's being weird, nature-like, I, uh, okay, this is not hot enough, it's not sizzling up, okay, so I need to get that going, um, I'm going to pause it. 